The money will be used to partially fund the rehabilitation of the track road between Ses and Gojas in the Karas and Hartab regions. This 228-kilometer road forms part of the Namibia National Track Network, which connects the harbor of Avas Bay and Venduk, as well as Namibia's northern neighbors with South Africa. Rehabilitation of this road will reduce operating costs, as well as increase longevity on the road. It will also boost local and regional trade through easy and effective transportation of goods and services through the Transkalahari and Kunene highways. Chief Executive Officer of Road Fund Administration Ali Ipinga said the collection of sufficient funding has been a challenge which will continue in the possible future. Ipinga said this will also result in a backlog of maintaining the section of the road network and other avenues to close the gap when necessary. We took up this loan facility is really to close that gap between what we can collect on a yearly basis and what we need to fund. So that gap, uh, we're happy that KFW has uh, agreed to assist us close that gap uh, with this uh, loan facility. The track road marks the second phase that will be rehabilitated with money borrowed from the German bank as RFA has previously loaned money from KFW on two other occasions. Road Authority Chief Executive Officer Konrad Lutombi explained why the track road between Ses and Gojas was selected to start with. The intention is to rehabilitate the whole um, section from Marienta to Kuno. But we have identified this section as critical because, first of all, the entire road has lived its lifespan. But this section, unfortunately, we cannot maintain it any, any longer. It will be a waste of resources. Therefore, that's why we are now... Uh, starting with this um, section and as we proceed when money becomes available we'll proceed with the project until uh, Gruno. Director of KFW recaps on the successes of the previously granted loans to RFA. Until today uh, 1,800 kilometers of uh, gravel roads have been uh, implemented, constructed in the, in the central north and around uh, 20, 20,000 people have um, uh, have had have, have found jobs uh, due to those uh, projects, and um, what what I have also seen with my own eyes is that it has really a very positive impact on uh, economic development in those uh, previously remote and not uh, connected uh, areas. The project will be managed by a road authority, and the loan repayment will start during the year 2021 and should be fully repaid by the road fund over a period of 10 years. Construction work is to start during the next financial year, 2018-2019. Evelyn Paulus, NBC News, Ventuk.